When I travel for either business or pleasure, I don't want to take along all kinds of bulky makeup. So when it comes to eyeshadow palettes, I still want some variety. I don't want to wear the same thing every day. So in this video, I'm highlighting this small Lorac Pro Matte palette that I got at Kohl's. And I actually use my Kohl's cash. So in the description box below, I have a link to this at both Kohl's and at Ulta. It's a small palette with eight colors. It's very versatile. So I'm going to show you next how I created this look. I've already done my face makeup and my eyebrows, so now I'm ready to start my Lorac palette. And usually I put on some kind of eyeliner first and then soften it out. Usually I use a crayon type, pencil type. But today I'm actually going to use um, a combination of the dark brown and the black and I'm going to use this little tiny brush and I'm going to dip it in water I brought a small bowl of water with me and I'm just going to dip it in the brown this is a very pigmented um, pigmented palette and I have my 10x mirror on the side so I'll be zooming into um, when I edit this but I have to make sure I have my computer with me and make sure I um, can still be seen. So this is so much easier to do when I'm not filming. So I just run this along the edges, but I'll probably fast forward. Now that I've done this dark brown here, I'm going to do a little bit of the black, but only a really thin line on the top and a little bit on the outer corners. And I forgot to mention that I already put on some eyeshadow primer from Smashbox as well. I dab this after I put eyeshadow in, I dab it on a Kleenex um, to get some of the extra off. Now I like to soften the eyeliner a bit and what I do is I use this short little angled brush and I'm going to go over it with this medium beige color. Now I'm ready to do my shadows and this palette has a really white color called linen over here and then it's got one that's a little more beigey. So what I'm going to do is put this beigey one all over the mobile lid to start off. And I'm going to use this bigger brush to do that. And this color is called Bear. Okay, so now that I'm wearing um, pink today, I'm going to go over the outer part of the mobile lid with, well, is that what I'm going to do? No, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to use the pink mauve and use this brush, um, which is a softer, um, not so dense kind of crease brush. And I'm going to go above the crease with the pink mauve. And now I'm going to blend it with this brush. Next, I'm going to take an actual crease brush that's more dense. And I'm actually going to put this color in. This is called Latte. And blend. All right, now I'm going to put a little bit of this burgundy. Hmm. I'm going to put it more toward the outer corner, but just right in here 
Oops, there's already some on there. All right, and there's Now I'll blend like crazy. Now I'm going to back go back over this um whoops this bear color. And I'm actually gonna put some below the brow, but I'm gonna go over it with some white what they call linen. Okay, and actually, you know what? I'm gonna take a little bit of this pink mauve and put it on the outer part of the mobile lid. And then, before I take a last look at this, I'm gonna use this white linen color and with this really flat, dense brush, I'm just going to put a little bit on the inner corner. I'm not putting any, and a little bit right under the brow. But I'm going to blend that out really well. All right, now off camera, I'm going to finish the look with mascara and lip, and I'll be right back. So this is the finished look with my tiny little palette from Lorac and if you watch till the end I will link to another video showing you a different look with a different palette that's also great for vacation. Thanks for watching. Bye. So today I'm going to show you, um, this is the Naked 2 from the Urban Decay Basics. I love this palette because it's not too dark, it looks like this. And um, yeah, so let's get started.